Um, no, honestly, um, I'm not sure. Um, you know, for us, it was just about, you know, we knew <clears throat> the first half, you know, wasn't a good defensive half for us. And, uh, you know, our offense kept us, kept us in the game. And, um, you know, we just came in at, at halftime and, um, you know, talked it over a little bit and just knew that come back out the second half, uh, it was all about what we needed to do and what we didn't do the first half. That the game starts on such a weird note, the crowd's jacked up, you guys are excited, and there's a pick six that goes the other way. What was your reaction when that happened, and how did you guys turn it around from there? Honestly, um, I mean, we, we wasn't uh, worried at all. Uh, you know, that's something we talk about all the time. You know, adversity is going to hit, and uh, it's how you respond to it, you know, that makes us uh, the team that we are. And, um, you know, when that pick six happened, you know, it was just like, all right, you know, dang. But, you know, it happened, and... Um, we got to go out there on defense and, um, and get one. And um, I think for the most part today, um, you know, it was just, we just played, played for 60 minutes, and um, we knew that's what it was going to take. Pat, just from a defender's point of view, how difficult is it to play against a quarterback that's on? Um, <clears throat> you know, what's that again? How difficult from a defender's point of view is Kaepernick to play against? Uh, you put me in a tough one. You asked me about my own teammate. <laughs> um, you know, I. Um, from what we see in practice, well, from what we see in the game, um, I mean, obviously, you know, to see a quarterback run the way that he runs, uh, man, that, I mean, that's that's unbelievable. And, um, you know, to see him in practice, you know, you never really see him open up like that in practice. You know, you see um, you see them do the offense that they do and, and whatnot. But, you know, but to see him do it in the game, it, it amazes me. It wows me. And I'm just like, wow, did he just do that? You know, and so um, credit goes to that whole offense, you know, to have a guy like, like Frank, who people have to, um, they have to account for. And then, you know, Cap doing what he's doing before you know it. You know, hopefully um, they don't know which one to go for. And um, both of them are running wild, which they did today. Can you talk about how impressive it is to see him through his development? I mean, so much to talk about with guys like RG3 and Andrew Luck, but, you know, those guys are out and Cap Collins still in it, helping you guys out. Yeah, uh, you know, just to see how fast he, he's picked up on the um, offense, just to see how fast he's picked up on the game, period. Um, I mean, it's, it's, it's remarkable. And, um, you know, I know that, you know, Cap's a guy who, who works every day and uh, he's very confident in himself, um, not conceded by no means. But if you see what we see every day, I mean, I, I get there and, um, you know, I'm, I'm a type of man, I don't like to be out of work. But honestly, you know, I, I, I get there to the facility and he's outside already warming up, you know. And um, I think he work out every day. I joke with him all the time. I'm like, man, you got to be one of the biggest and strongest quarterbacks, you know, I've, I've seen. But yet, you know, he plays a position like a true quarterback. And, um, that's what that's what it's going to take, and I'm just happy to see him do that. And uh, he done well for us today. And uh, we got to, you know, it doesn't stop here. We got a big game next week, and wherever we play, and uh, that's our, you know, that's our next focus. Pat, you can talk about how fast he picks things up. How fast is he though, when you see him on the field? Man, I mean, he's he's fast. Uh, you know, to see him, um, I mean, it's it, it's it's one thing, you know, when you see him get a uh, guy get behind the guy and they try to run, and the guy already has a step on him. But you know, to see a guy come across the field at an angle. And he eats up the angle. That's to us, you know. That's fast, you know. That's that guy's moving. And um, like I said, it's it's great to have a have him doing what he's doing. And um, and not only not only is his speed remarkable, just to see how he's throwing the ball and seeing how he's getting behind, you know, other guys. I mean, that that's amazing too. And I mean, my hat goes off to the offensive uh, side of the ball. Like I said today, they they uh, when our defense was struggling, you know, they kept us in there. And that second half, we knew that. If we came back out and we we played to the level that they was playing and, and even higher, then that game would uh, it would be ours and um, you know that's that was the outcome. We Last won. one, guys. Can you talk about the overall defensive performance and what would you like to see improve as you go into the next game? Really, um, for the most part, it's just about um, we just have to we have to start faster. You know, we we uh, especially you know uh, against. I mean, it's not gonna get any easier. Uh, whoever it is we play, we have to play. We have to start fast and play for sixty minutes and. Um, you know, we, we didn't do that today, um, but we did finish, and that's the most important. And um, But, yeah, you know, I would just like to see us start faster and, um, and continue to do what we do.